When the family of popular Hollywood actor Bruce Willis announced he was stepping away from acting because he's been diagnosed with aphasia, many people had never even heard of the condition. It's a brain disorder that leads to problems with speaking, reading, and writing, and it causes people to lose the ability to understand and express speech. The primary knowledge is that um, it is not a cognitive disorder. It's a language disorder. It is not a disease in and of itself. It's the result of something else. Many also don't know that here at Penn State, the Semantics, Aphasia, and Neurodynamics, or SAND lab, focuses on finding ways to improve the lives of those with language disorders, including aphasia. Dr. Shaylee Sandberg is the lab's principal investigator. Uh, one of the reasons that I got interested in aphasia was uh, the the very thought that you could have a fully functioning language system and that there could be some, some sort of event like a stroke that would just take that away from you. I think that's the biggest thing is understanding, um, you know, the, the confidence that these people have and then understanding that there's ways to really um, reveal that competence in the way that you adapt your communication. Researchers here at the SAND Lab have been working on multiple projects related to therapy treatment and counseling for those with aphasia. They hope that their research will help some of the millions of people impacted by this condition. In University Park, I'm Casey Zanowick for the Center County Report. We hope you enjoyed watching the video. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you did. For the rest of our newscast and featured stories, click here. And for sports, click here. Have a great day and thanks for watching.